Good morning. It is another, well, it's been rainy. It's not necessarily a beautiful day here in Oregon, um, but my mom's birthday is coming up in the next few days. So I am going to send her a present. I've been meaning to give this to her for a while. I figure now is the perfect time, but in case you didn't know, um, give me a second. So in case you didn't know, ah, um, I am Native American and my mom well, my grandpa is 100% Native American, and my mom used to have this drum that he made, and we had it for many, many, many years, and somewhere along the, the line, I think, like, my brother now has it, if he still has it, um, and when Mindy, our friend Mindy, was moving out of her house, she had this drum on her wall, and I asked what she was going to do with it, and she told me I could have it, and it's a Canadian Native American drum. Um, so it's a little dusty, but I thought it was really cool. And I think that my mom would love it. I think she'd really appreciate it. So I'm going to send this to her for her birthday along with the card. Uh, I doubt she'll see this video <laughs> before she gets it. Um, her birthday is in just a few days. So I'm going to run to USPS or UPS to go ship that out. Um, and then my goal for today is to figure out what I'm going to do for these stairs or this step because I hate it. I hate how it came out and I just, I can't let it go. So it doesn't necessarily look too bad and then you get right here and boom, it's just ugh. So I was like, what could I do right there? So I'm thinking I might do actual real tile. I wouldn't put mortar down. I would just glue it and then put um, grout. Um, so I'm going to go to Home Depot and see what they have as far as real tile that would be small enough that I could work around this weird curve that we have going on here. And I might even buy another um, drip like this. They have a longer one. It's a little bit more expensive, but I don't know. We'll, we'll see how it goes once I get to the store. But before I leave, before we get to driving, I wanted to say a huge thank you to a couple of people uh, enjoy your gift. I hope this helps with the van build. You're doing a great job from Denise E. Matthews. So Denise, these are, I'm not going to show you guys yet, but if, if you know, you know, um, these are the knobs that I'm going to be using for the cabinetry. I absolutely love them. I haven't opened it yet, but online they look beautiful. So I'm excited to see what they look like in person. Um, but thank you so much, Denise. So this one doesn't have a um, card to say who it's from, but you commented on my video. I don't remember the name. I'm so sorry. Um, feel free to comment on this video so I can thank you again. But, uh, this person purchased this thing. It is like an activity tray for Ember's car seat. So when we're traveling, um, she'll have a lot of, a lot of things to do that will distract her. And you guys will see all of that later when we take our first trip together. But she also sent these uh, coloring tablets in some washable markers. Oh, dry erase markers. So these are really, really cool. Ember actually has um, a dinosaur one that she loves, but it'll be good to have one in the van so I don't have to constantly track them back and forth. But those things are really, really awesome. If you have kids, I highly recommend them. They're way better than the, uh, the magnetic ones where you have to move it to erase it because Ember can't move that thing on her own. This one, you just press a button and it starts over and she knows how to do that. It's really easy, but thank you so much for that. So all of that being said, I don't think that you understand how much it really helps. Uh, so thank you again. And if you guys want to be immortalized in the van build as well, um, I do have the link to the Amazon wish list in the description and all of that's just for the van build itself. If you want to help out, I do appreciate it. So let's go ahead and 
make our way to Home Depot and see what they have to work with as far as tile goes. I don't know. Okay, so UPS and FedEx are both closed today because it's Sunday. So I won't be mailing that out to my mom until tomorrow. So I just got home and it was raining so hard. And it said, the weather said it was not supposed to be raining today. And it's raining. It's not raining too bad right now, but it's just frustrating because I was not trying to work in the rain. I'm just frustrated. <sighs> so, so today's mission is just doing this front step here. So I'm gonna take that off. I'm gonna take this off. And we'll test this out. This is what I got. It was really small, so I figured it'd be easier to work with. We'll see how it goes. I think this is gonna look cool!
it's raining <laughs> pretty pretty hard so i'm gonna have to stop this for now this is how far i've gotten i'm i think once it's uh grouted it's gonna look way better than what was on there but i'm gonna close up shop for now let that dry and i'll get back to it if it stops raining hopefully it does but it's just getting harder and harder i gotta go so it finally stopped raining the sun came out a little bit but it was cold so i had to put on a sweater and some socks and shoes but look who's outside outside say hi hi <laughs> So we're gonna get back to it and hopefully get this done pretty quickly. I'm almost done. We just have to finish this side and that side. And then I'm gonna let the glue set before I grout. So here we go. Okay, so I'm done gluing and I need to let this sit and set up and dry before I can grout. Um, I think it's gonna look better than it did with the other fake stuff that I had on there. Ooh. Let's see. It kind of looks something like that, but better, so. Once the grout's in there, I think it'll look really, really nice. Um, so I'm gonna let that sit up. I think I only used three packs and then I have this much left from the third pack. So I can take that other one back. These were $10 per sheet. So they were not very cheap. Um, so I'll take that last one back. And then once it's all set up, I will start grouting. Um, so I will see you in just a second when we start grouting. Good morning guys, it's a new day and I just got done with installing my solar panel. And as you guys saw earlier in this video, um, we are working on the tile. So it's been a couple days because I wanted to let the tile set and that glue dry. So it's set, so we are going to start working on the grout now. But in between that, we got the solar, not the solar, we got the whole electrical system done. And so now it's time to get back to, get back to this mission and get this finished and done. I'm really excited. Let's get it done.
Wow, that looks so much better. So obviously it's still drying, but that looks way better. And then on the, um, and then on the bottom right here, I'm going to have carpet. So it'll really look finished and put together once that's in, but this looks so much better than what was on there before. I'm really happy with it. I'm so in love with how this came out. I don't think I can express how much or how happy I am. I'm so glad that I decided to to scrap that first idea and and do the tile. Guys, it's dry, it's done, it's beautiful. I'm even considering not putting a box there like I wanted to. I don't know what's going to happen, but I don't think I need it and I think it makes it feel even more open. So I think I'm just going to leave it alone for now. I am going to paint that bottom plastic piece right here black and put a rug down and then it'll be really finished but as far as the tile itself I'm really happy with how it came out I like I'm over the moon and that's just one step closer to the van being done I am really curious to hear what you guys think um do you think it was a good move going with the tile because I do think it was a good move going with the tile I've done tile quite a few times and I'm really, really happy and I'm always like so happy with how it comes out. So I definitely think that I have a love for real tile, but definitely let me know what you think. As always, thank you so much for watching and just know that you guys are loved and you're appreciated. I cannot wait to hear your thoughts on this and I will see you guys on the next video and hoping to hear from you in the comments.